Welcome back, everyone. So, if you haven't noticed, I have Haley here again today, and we're going to be doing something fun. Um, I'm going to see just how much my wife knows about roller coasters. I'm going to ask her some questions. Some of them are ones that she has to answer. Some of them are multiple choice. I'm going to be asking her 10 questions, which all together are worth 15 points, and there's a couple opportunities for bonus points as well. Whoa. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, let's do this. All right, question number one is going to be worth two points. RMC is a roller coaster manufacturer that became popular during the 2010s by retrofitting old, unpopular wooden coasters into steel hybrids with their steel iBox track and would also build many ground up creations. I've been on three RMCs to date. Name two RMCs that I've personally experienced. Um, been on three. You have to name two. All of them are among my favorite coasters. They're all ranked pretty high. To, yeah, I just had to think for a second. Okay, um, the voyage. Is that an answer? <laughs> Me. Okay. Um. Um. <laughs> Ravine Flyer? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I lose. <laughs> no. no guesses? No, nothing? Uh, nothing else? Okay. I don't know. Alright, so the three RMCs that I've experienced are Twisted Timbers, Steel Vengeance, and Lightning Rod. So. I wouldn't have guessed that. Yeah. <laughs> two two iBox conversions of old wooden coasters and Lightning Rod's a ground up coaster. Yeah, so on to question number two, which is worth one point. What does RMC stand for? Mm. <laughs> roller Coaster Company? Roller Motor Company? How does... <laughs> <laughs> roller Motor Company. <laughs> I don't know. If I didn't say anything, you would have made me guess anyway. So those are my guesses. <laughs> No, nothing guess. else you've never i know you've heard this before i probably but you, have but i don't remember right now you know you hear me list off these manufacturer names you don't remember what rmc you know think of mountains think of mountains <laughs> what are mountains rocks you're, you're sort of getting there rocky mountain company <laughs> that's really close that is really close <laughs> Is the C at least company? <laughs> no, that's actually the word that you got wrong. Rocky Mountain Corp. <laughs> I'm going to give you half a point because <laughs> it's Rocky Mountain Construction, but what? I don't know. I wasn't going to guess construction. Well, hey, you got to play fair and square, you know? I'll give you half a point because you got Rocky Mountain. Question number three. Now, there's an opportunity for a bonus point here, okay? So, what roller coaster at Cedar Point opened the year I was born? So, you get one point for answering that, and then you can get one bonus point if you name the manufacturer of that coaster as well. I honestly have no idea, so I guess I'll guess. <laughs> it, it's, okay, I will say, it's a coaster you've been on. So, the coaster opened the year I was born. It's one that you've personally ridden. <laughs> It's cl it's closer to the front of the park. I don't remember where they are in the park. I haven't been there in so long. <laughs> Is it a wooden coaster? Cedar Point only has one wooden coaster. It opened in 1964. So no, it's not. Okay. It's not a wooden coaster. <laughs> Is it Magnum? <sighs> nope. Mm. It is not Magnum. <laughs> it is not. That's not why I guessed it. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> No. Raptor opened in the year Raptor. I was born. I love Raptor. Yeah, I told you you've been on it. Yeah. Well, See? I mean, I've right been on the front of the park. pretty much all of them. Yeah. So. Who manufactured Raptor? It's a very, very prestigious roller coaster manufacturer. One of the top dogs in the roller coaster industry. Been around for quite a while. Um, Intamin, RMC, 
<laughs> I don't know. It's the good guesses, but it is not. Intamin is the other like premier roller coaster manufacturer. B&M? Is that what it is? Yes, it's B and M. Yes. <laughs> All right, I'll give it to you. You got it. I, so I said she, it before you said it. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. So she got one point actually here. So. But that bonus point helped her out a little bit, so... I was just trying to think of all the different manufacturers <laughs> that I've heard you say. Yeah. <laughs> uh, should I give it to her because she was listing off other ones first? I don't know, yeah, but we'll give, <laughs> we'll give it to her. We'll give it to her. We'll give it to her. Okay. This next one is pretty fun here. I'm going to give her five choices here for this next question. Okay, all five of these roller coaster names are real, except for one. Which roller coaster name is fake? This question's worth one point. Um, so your choices are A, Orphan Rocker, B, Dizzy Love and Whirling Passion, C, Dog Fart, D, Whirling Buzzsaw Coaster, and E, Flying and Floating Over the Clouds and Water. So out of those five names, which one is fake? I want to say dog fart, but I feel like that's too obvious. I mean, all these <laughs> all these names are pretty out there. I mean, but that. I mean, I'm not like... gonna I'm not gonna tell you if it's right or not. You got you just gotta pick one. I mean, it's multiple choice. You might be onto something, or you might not. No. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna guess E because that seems like a really long name for a ride. <laughs> it is a very long name. So E's your final answer. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> flying and floating over the clouds and water is a roller coaster in China that opened in 2015, and it's one of those uh, knockoffs of the Vacoma SLCs. The actual <laughs> fake name here that I made up is Whirling Buzzsaw Coaster. Pretty, pretty cool for a name, if I must say so myself. So dog cool fart name. is real. Dog fart. <laughs> okay. The dog fart coaster is it's actually coaster. called, it's called Honda Prutton, but it translates to dog fart in English. Uh, yeah, it's at, it's at Bon Bon Land, which is in Denmark. So yeah, the dog fart coaster is a real thing. Question number five. The, there's actually an opportunity for a bonus point here as well. Um, name one of the parks that I was planning on visiting in June. Not sure if that trip's still happening. But I was supposed to be visiting several parks in June. So name one that I was planning on visiting. And if you can name any more, I'll give you a bonus point. I should know this, but I <laughs> really, I can't she remember. She don't pay attention when I talk. Yes, I do. But you talk about so many different parks all the time. Uh-huh. You do. I don't, I, I don't remember. She don't remember what parks I was planning on going to. Wah, wah, wah. I guess nope. I'm a bad wife. <laughs> Terrible. Mm -hmm. All right, no guesses, nothing. I'm really trying to think because I feel like I should know that, but I'm Mo just like I think most... it's because you're asking me right now. I can't think of it. <laughs> Mo most of them are parks I haven't been to. Um, lots of bucket list parks and bucket list coasters that I would cross off if I went to these places. Is one of them a Six Flags Park? One of them is a Six Flags Park. The but first park we're going to. I can't remember all the names of the Six Flags Park. Fair enough. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna give I'm gonna give her half a point for that. That's the first park um, that we were supposed to be hitting up. Kings Island. Yeah, you could have guessed like Hershey Park, Six Flags Great Adventure, is the Six Flags Park that. Was supposed to be first on the list. Dorney Park, along with a few other ones, but I remember she... you saying that, but I don't remember the word Dorney is not <laughs> a word <laughs> that sticks in my brain. <laughs> so yeah. I th I thought maybe you'd get Hershey Park though. I thought maybe you'd get Hershey Park, but you know that's pretty. I honestly line. don't remember you telling me you're going to Hershey Park. Yeah, Hershey Park's one of them. All right, well, <laughs> um, she gets half a point for that question. I'll give her half point. Because she said Six Flags, but, you know, there's 15, well, 12 parks with the name Six Flags on them. Question number six. Six Flags Magic Mountain in Valencia, California has 
more roller coasters than any other park in the world. How many coasters does Six Flags Magic Mountain currently have? And this question is worth one point. Mm. Um, 25. <laughs> I, that'd be awesome, but no. <laughs> it's, it's not 25. Any final guesses? Mm, 17. Nope. All right. <laughs> Six Flags Magic Mountain currently has 19 roller coasters. Good guesses. Question number seven. What is the name of the tallest roller coaster in the world? This question is worth one point. And it is worth noting it's also the fastest in North America. There's one faster in the world, but it's still the tallest roller coaster in the world. What is the name? Uh, top Thrill. Good guess. Is it a... Very similar ride. Okay, uh... I know what one you're talking about, but I can't think of the name of it. Right oh. now. Okay, it's at the Six Flags Park that I was supposed to be going to in June. If that helps you. Probably not, but... I can't remember the name of it. Alright, the <laughs> tallest roller coaster in the world is King de Ka. Oh my god, I almost said that. But I didn't want to say that and feel stupid if I was wrong. Oh my gosh. Yeah, what? I didn't want to, what? I didn't want to... You should have said it. Yeah, that's what kept popping now in I my head. Now I can't give you the point. Uh, that's what kept popping into my head, but I was like, that could just be some random something. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, well. Yes, Kane Deca is 456 feet tall. Top Thrill Dragster is 420 feet. It's the second tallest in the world. It was the tallest when it opened. Kane Deca opened two years later, took its record. So, mm. Question number eight. I have three wooden roller coasters currently in my top 10 overall. Name one of the wooden coasters in my top 10 besides Ravine Flyer 2. This question is worth one point. Well, I know one of them has to be The Voyage. That's correct. That's correct. Um... Now, you only have to name one of them to get the point, but do you oh. know the other one? Mm, Main Street? <laughs> mean streak <laughs> what was it? I don't know, one of those. mean streak's one of the worst coasters i've been on <laughs> and it doesn't exist anymore it's i was just steel trying Vengeance to think now. of another oh okay so <laughs> okay we have a fun one here question number nine now th this question is worth two points and there are there are hyper coasters there's Giga Coasters and there's Strata Coasters. What classifies a Giga Coaster? Um, how tall the biggest drop is? Um, yeah, the height or biggest drop, but how how big does it have to be? Over two hundred. At least. Nope. Over two fifty. <laughs> no, a Giga Coaster. Over three hundred. <laughs> yes, it is three hundred. Um. I'll, I'll give you one point for that one. I'll give you one point for it because I'm adorable. But yeah, Giga Coaster is you know 300 to 399 feet. 400 is a Strata Coaster, and then you know Hyper Coasters are 200 to 299. So the last question here, this is the big one. Okay, this one is worth a total of four points. Oh boy! So you can earn anywhere from one to four points for this. Um, I'm going to show you a couple pictures, okay. and these are coasters that I've been on. I rode both of them last year. They were pretty high on my bucket list, so I'm going to show you the picture, and we'll see if you know what they are. Okay. And also, these are both Giga Coasters. Giggity Coasters? Giggity, giggity. <laughs> giggity, 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 giggity. Oh. What roller coaster is pictured here, and what park is it at? One point for each. Mm. Name of the coaster and name of the park it's at. Just but, based on that picture, I have no idea. <laughs> okay. Think to the coasters that I was talking about a lot before I went on my trip last year. Do you remember, like, the coasters I was really excited to get on the most? Lightning Rod? Oh, wait, that was before you went to Dollywood. Yeah, that was before I went to Dollywood. <laughs> Well, you went on two trips last year. So, I'm trying to remember. I don't know. Okay. You don't know the park either? 
No. Didn't he guesses on King's Dominion or something. <laughs> I might have. You might but, have. But what park is this at? Do you know? Um. To your point. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> this is Fury Three Two Five at Carowinds. Carowinds. Yes, Fury Three Two Five, which was like my it was my number one bucket list coaster. It's the tallest roller coaster in the world that has a chain lift. So, besides coasters that have launches, this one is the tallest in the world at 325 feet tall. What roller coaster is pictured here, and what park is it at? Mm -hmm. One of the two parks I went to in June of last year. That one would be King's Dominion, right? <laughs> is it? And uh... It is. It's King's Dominion. So, there's one point so far. I'm trying to think. I don't remember. <laughs> Just look at it, though. Just I'm look at it. at it. Okay. Look! Look how crazy it looks. Mm -hmm. Look how crazy that ride looks. Yeah. Not not jogging your memory. <laughs> it, it's themed to a race car driver, if that oh. helps you. I remember you talking about it, but you've definitely I've definitely talked about this one well, a lot. You talk about a lot of roller coasters <laughs> all the time. <laughs> So, um, wait, what was the first one called? The first one was called Fury 325. Okay. This one is not called Fury 325. <laughs> <laughs> that clears that up for me. Thank you. <laughs> um, I, I don't know. Okay. This one, she got one point for this question. Um, one point out of four because she guessed King's Dominion right for this one. This is Intimidator 305. I-305. So. I knew it had numbers in it. <laughs> yeah. But all I could think of was Fury 325. One of the most intense coasters on the planet. This is the the gray out and black out inducing coaster. Oh, yeah. right. Okay. Yeah. Awesome ride. Uh, one of the two giga coasters I rode on that trip. The two giggity ones. Yeah. Giggity, 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 giggity. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah. <laughs> All right, thank you guys for watching this fun video here today. Let me know what you thought of it, and um, please don't roast me too hard. <laughs> ask these questions to your friends and family, and see how well they do on this quiz. And let me know how did they do. Let me know in the comments what you thought about this, and I'll see you guys next time. This is Coaster Daddy and Coaster Mommy. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>